hey guys welcome to another video with me your girl Latoya and if you're new to my channel I mean welcome to the Lyman family guys I am currently in Portland Jamaica Portland nice to see I'm pretty and listen Portland nice but as you saw in the title today I will be going to Sea Cliff Resort and Spa and yes it's in Portland Jamaica now I have relatives in Portland so it's easy for me to find somewhere to stay but if you don't have any relatives in Portland or if you are traveling from overseas and they need somewhere to stay then why not check out a resort and spa so Sea Cliff Resort and Spa is a relatively new resort and so I've heard one or two persons talk about it so I'm like why not vlog the resort for my viewers so guys stick around because we're going to find out if sea cliff resort and spa is a place you want to stay when you visit portland jamaica I'm so hot but guess what I have my key for my white cap room so let's go inside to see how it looks so as you enter to your left you have the bathroom come with me let me show you what the bathroom looks like I can say it's different than the other big resorts that we go to we give you the zinc type of friends feeling i have to double check to make sure this is zinc i love the space i like the feeling you get like an outside feeling like a weird outside so the space is nice like things are going on and i like that they put the sink right here in the center of the bathroom water is there guys and of course you have the toilet so right outside the bathroom you're automatically in the room itself um the, the white cap comes with this master bed and so that's a plus the first thing i also notice is that they have their iron board and you have two robes one two then you have your little mini fridge here they also have their little safe so you can lock away your personal items and you have these lights which are at the bed side so you can turn it on also when you are ready and it's a bit big and feel comfortable already so so far so good you have your tv here your nice little couch you know, you sit down you can read oh i brought my book to read so i can definitely sit here you have your ceiling fan and of course the room has to come with an ac so the ac is right where the entrance and exit door is guys you have this big table right here and listen big table is for me because i'm going to put everything here your makeup your your roll on everything you have your big mirror and of course girl i feel like you're going to use the mirror and i can see here you have your items to make your tea or a little coffee you have your kettle here uh, i guess this would be for the coffee i'm assuming i don't know what this is but i don't really drink coffee that much but guys you have two cups so Perfect. I said this is the basket here. I'm not sure what this is for, but I guess if you come here, you want to purchase your snacks, you can put your snacks in this basket. Because as I said before, they don't provide you lunch or dinner, only breakfast. So guys, come with me. I see something outside looking really excited. You know me, love being outside. So nothing is perfect than this. Come guys. So guys, watch this. Watch this. Watch this. We can't wait for later. Come and look on the view. Right guys, let me go in there first before I turn on the pipe to show you that I can fit. See guys? I'm fitting. So this is a plus. And of course I'm going to always check if there's water because I mean there are more. And guys, the 
view is breathtaking guys look at this oh i should mention that there's a hammock here boy i mean i don't know if this but tonight i'm gonna show you i'm gonna try i'm gonna don't laugh if i'm dropping now Hui. Hui. oh my gosh guys like this is perfect you can imagine when night fall and you're just looking up in the sky at the stars and all so cool it is so relaxed like that this is a really getaway place like i like the hammock idea let me come out see yeah, yeah. and of course you have a nice little table where you can dine outside if you want to i mean i have to come outside later but come here guys look on the view here i see why them name sea cliff Inside, but turn on the AC and say everything is working. No one say come. So guys, I'm gonna check if the AC is working. It should be working, but I don't see why it won't. So let me just move this. Close the door. Hmm. What are these lights for? Okay. No, I don't know how to turn on the AC. Oh, they did them for that trick, me, but they didn't. Found it, guys. My heart. Turn on the AC. I'm not checking the weather. I'm going to lock the balcony door because we want in here cool, cool, and nice, right? Ooh. Guys, so in here, bright, watch your trick here. Guys, I'm not editing this in the I'm not editing it because I don't want it to happen to you. So let me fix this back, guys. I mean, alright. So I'm going to reach it, but you don't get the idea. I just want to call somebody to put it up back. But, guys, yeah, so once the curtains are drawn, you have this nice, you know, dark, romantic ambiance. So let me get for the remote. Come on, check if the TV at work. And guys, my feet cool already. Yep. The TV's working. I look like I have. What do you call this now? I look like I have Netflix, I have Prime, I have YouTube, I have everything. Guys, I'm extremely exhausted. So I'm just going to sign up for now. But I have property tour, trip, property tour to show you guys. I heard that there is pool here. So I definitely walk by the pool. I didn't bring any swim gears because your girl never knows the pool there. But much of the thing. With their Portland outer beaches, why not bring us in where? Okay. So guys, this is the other room. I don't remember the name of this room, but I would definitely let you guys know. So for this one, when you step inside, the bathroom is actually to your right. And this is how the bathroom looks that's me so it's smaller than the one that i went in first but guys i love the decor for this i love this this concrete wall thingy it's just cute and that's the show ahead so this is the bath guys And this comes with two double bed and you have your safe so for this one it doesn't come with robe it also doesn't come with mini fridge and it also doesn't come with a television however they do have Wi-Fi access in both rooms 
that's me again guys so this is the view from the balcony and let me see if I can go outside so this also has a good view it also has a hammock but it doesn't have the outside shower as the white cap so this is the view from the balcony guys so let's go back inside the ceiling fan the AC so this is the view for this room I'll definitely put the name of this room on the screen so you will be able to see which to choose from so guys as you know um, Seacliff doesn't give you lunch um, or dinner and so we're going to go on the road we're very close to Boston Jerk Center so we're just gonna go there now to get something to eat and come back we'll maybe try and find a, a supermarket or somewhere to buy some snack and buy some juice to put in our fridge so we're gonna leave out now to go to Boston Jerk so guys stay tuned I'm gonna take me to go going and bed but look at me need to get some food so guys <laughs> come with me to Boston Jerk So guys i just got back in off the road we went to boston jerk we had the chicken while coming back to the resort we had jerk chicken um roast sweet potato and uh, festival we also stopped at a little supermarket when i said little yeah, little but it makes sense and we got some snack not a lot because we're not there forever we're just spending one night so we just got a few little snacks here and then we also purchased some things for the fridge so let me show you what we put in there so we have these and we have our water so now time to have a bath and relax in this big old bed watch some tv listen guys i'm tired i'm gonna say i said oh looks a pop down don't worry on yourself that's why i'm here i'm really pop down so that's why i'm gonna relax and <laughs> it's actually a little bit after four i was gonna bathe in the shower but <laughs> i'm gonna bathe outside <laughs> guys i just noticed something with here so there's a lot of privacy so you have this zinc cup thing here and you have this zinc cup thing here when i say zinc cup it doesn't mean like oh zinc cup is just cute and fancy but i realized that there is a door here so if it is that you and other persons come on their next door i mean you can always open this and then everybody's together makes sense right so guys that's a plus so i'm setting my bath now um how oh, you close this now so guys i'm on the balcony now i can hardly see the place is so dark but from where my room is i can see the restaurant and as you can see persons are dining and that's the check-in area there so guys this is the property in the night so around that section is where our room is and also where the check-in area is Good morning, Portland. Guys, this was so soothing last night while I slept. You can hear the ocean like, listen, this was what I needed. Good morning. 
morning long bay portland jamaica guys as you know we're at sea cliff resort and spa i'm actually at the front of the property because what i like to do is to vlog the property in the mornings where there is less people so you don't you know go into people privacy so let's start our property vlog so this sign is telling you where the restaurant and parking are at and so we're just going to go ahead as you can see portland is always nice and this property is so huge so gorgeous and guys this is it so right here the sign is saying to the restaurant which is to your left and i'm just going to go to my left normally i would just show you the check-in area but being that i'm already over this side i'm just going to go ahead and show you where the restaurant is and there's two entrances to the restaurant you have this side and you have the side where the check-in area is so that section is not a part of the resort itself it seems to be someone's property that is also gorgeous i like the unique design so here to your right you have the restaurant but i'm going to continue on to my left just to show you the ocean view guys you can see the rising sun it is so beautiful oh my gosh so guys this is the restaurant So I'm going to go back to the front and go to the direction where the check-in is. So now guys, I'm right at the front of the property again. So now I'm just going to go to my right where you have the parking and check-in areas. So a lot of banana trees. You have your nice decor here on the fence. Just thinking if I could get some banana before I leave. <laughs> so guys, this is a parking area. I don't want to show person's vehicle and license plate. But this is where you park. And here is a section of the property. These are some of the rooms. And you will always have signs to show you where certain things are so the sign is telling me that the pool area is around that section and that sign is telling me that the check-in is around this section now the rooms that we are staying in are located over this side these are the white caps room and these are the rooms that are more on the expensive side I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing this right, but it says the Picaroons room. So you have the stairs to lead them upstairs to their respective room. I'm going to show you one of the room I went in yesterday. So I went into this room. I think this is called the reef room. So that's the area where the check-in is. But I'm just going to go around this area where the sign says is the pool. So let's go around the pool area, guys. So around this section is the back of the property for the building I was just showing you guys. So all the buildings, well, the back of the building faces the sea. So this is where you have the pool area and this section leads you to the sea let's continue down to this section to see where it takes us and then we come back to the pool area I look before I go. Guys, 
I'm a bit scared. So I'm just gonna stop right here, okay? Uh, water is very rough. But the scenery is very beautiful. And I just like over here. I think I guess that's why they call it sea clip because look at the fish area right there. It's so gorgeous. But as I said, you can continue down to go and see what guys. You think me ever got on this one? Look back. Only thing me ever got on this one? Where's the chance with? But guys, I like this view. I just want my privacy. You can come down here in the night and relax and you know, watch the ocean. But me? So let us go back to view the pool area and then we're going to go around the side where you check in and to show you the different entrance to the restaurant. So come on. So based on what I'm seeing, this section of a pool is around 7 feet deep. Then you have, I think it's probably 4. I'm not sure, but I didn't go into the pool. I don't think I'm going to go into the pool because I didn't bring any swim gear, one. And two, I'm just not feeling the pool vibes. But guys, if you are here, you can come and you can go into the pool. That's the, exp that's the affordable rooms here from the pool view. And this is the pool, the swim up bar. So guys we are now around the front again we're going to the check-in area and restaurant now look at this beautiful little decor now these are the white cap rooms uh, you have room number three two and one we're actually staying in room one so our room is pretty much close to the restaurant and check-in area so let's now go to view around this section So over that side is the check-in area. Over there is the restaurant. I have a nice little swing and as usual, I'm gonna go on the swing. This reminds me of a poor again. Grand Palladium, they had a swing too. Woo! And I said just that one here in a boat. So far so good. So this is where we sat yesterday. We did our check-in, our temperature checks, and all of that. So nice, beautiful place. Come and show you this side of the restaurant now. Ta-da! So this is the restaurant area, guys. So it looks. And around this section, you have your your bathroom. You can go down here about section, and you can use here. So that's where I was at the beginning of the property view. So I guess this is convenient for persons who, you know, visit the property and who has to use the wheelchairs. So this is a good ramp for them to come up to the restaurant area. So that's perfect. That's well thought of. So I like that. And that's where we were. When I'm looking at this, I can say, you know, if you want to get married, I guess they would fix up this area for you, and you can have your wedding ceremony right there. And then boom, you just jump come over for your reception. I never think about that. But guys, so here it leads you down to another section of the restaurant area. So this is a bar, or I believe it's a bar. Where you come and you can sit. The chair up here is wet, so I am. I'm assuming it's a night view or maybe it rained a little bit last night but guys so far so good you can sit here and you can view the ocean like this is a perfect view guys sitting here relaxing reading your book you can be playing games you can just chit chatting with your friends perfect area to do such and I saw them set up this area last night but I was so tired I went to bed but I mean if you want to have your sexual dinner they will fix this area especially for that event if you want to and propose to <laughs> propose to your significant other they will fix this area for you and you know you can do your proposal so guys that's it for the property tour and that's my room right there 
I'm getting hot, so I'm gonna go back fresh up and prepare for breakfast that is inclusive with the money we paid to stay here. So you see, it's not so bad. We might not get lunch and breakfast. We might not get lunch and the dinner, but we'll get breakfast. So, girl, I'll fix up for breakfast. But for now, I'm gonna go in my hammock at the back, relax, and listen to the ocean. See you later, guys. Hey guys, welcome to the review section of my video. I'm still at Seacliff Resort. I'm still in my room and I'm hungry. I thought that breakfast would be at 8. It's now actually 8.20. We were told that breakfast would be at 8.30. I think that's a bit too late for breakfast, but I mean, it is what it is. So guys, now to start <laughs> this review. I'm super excited. I don't know why. So we journeyed here from Kingston all the way in Portland. We made a couple stops in Portland because we have relatives. Well, I have relatives in Portland. And so let us talk about the journey from Port Antonio to get to Long Bay. Guys, the road bad. When we say the road bad, the road bad from Port Antonio till a little bit after you pass Boston Jerk. I must say though that the road is bad because there's road, road construction going on. So little from this, the road smooth, nice like butter. So from Boston Jerk Center to get here to the resort, you have the smooth road. So that's a plus. So if you're coming here, you have to put that into consideration that the road is not good. So you may want to drive one, you know, one of them tough four wheel car and thing, but so now to talk about the rooms uh when i came here based on the site you have to make a down payment 50 percent for the room but i had a spur of the moment so i just came here and luckily there was a room available i got the opportunity to look into the reef room i'm not sure if that's the name of the room but i will post the name of the room here so the re the reef room has two double bed and everything else what they don't have is that they don't have a fridge in that room and they don't have a TV in that room. So I mean if you're not a TV person that is fine for you and if you don't like your drinks cold then that's fine for you as well. But for me I like even though I'm here to relax I like watching TV and I also like the setup of the white cap room that I that I selected and so the white cap room has a television it's not really big but i mean it is what it is it also has a mini fridge now there were two bottles of water in the fridge and so we decided to you know journey back into uh boston jerk to get food we saw a little supermarket we bought some snacks and some juice and additional water to put in the fridge so you have to put that in mind that this resort is not an a all-inclusive resort what they do include in the package is breakfast that I'm still waiting on. So you have to keep that in mind that it's not an all-inclusive, so they do provide you with lunch and or dinner. They do have a restaurant though that you can go and purchase your dinner, have your dinner, and the prices are quoted in US dollars. We didn't go to the restaurant last night because we had the Boston jerk chicken and so we weren't hungry when it came like around eight o'clock. So we had our snacks, we had our drinks and we have our water. We're still waiting on the breakfast. Guys, all in all, the property is beautiful. I like that the, the back of the rooms face the ocean, which is calming and soothing. I must say the ocean, the sound of the ocean is very soothing to the body. If you are a person who likes entertainment and slides and see kids and you know all the hype thing, then this is not the resort for you. Uh, this resort, however, is for persons who you know you want to get away from the stress, you want to come here and relax with your spouse, your family and your friend then this is perfect for you it's very quiet it's very calming the ocean view the sound of the ocean is very soothing so you know if you're that type of person then you can come here and relax uh, you can make arrangements with them if you want to have and it's a special dinner for you know you know to propose so all in all guys I had a beautiful time if I should rate this uh, in percentage I would have to say I will give it 80% I mean I can't really grade it that much because I, I i don't know what to compare this resort to because i mean it's not an all-inclusive so whereas i went to other all-inclusive hotel i can you know 
give my review to see which is better which is not but for here it's different so in order for me to rate this i may have to go to other resort that is not all inclusive so i can give you a proper feedback guys this is the end of my review thanks for watching my video if you have not yet subscribed to my channel please to hit the subscribe button down below thumbs up this video post your comments i would definitely respond and share thanks for watching and i'll see you in my next video Toodles.